it's Karen. Welcome back. Um, I'm just going to come on today. I haven't made a video for probably a week and a half and I'm going to be gone next week uh, on vacation and I just want to get out and I found some awesome items and I just had to share them. I'm, I just excited over it. Um, so anyway, I hope you're all doing well. I hope you're enjoying um, you know, the weather, wherever you're at. Um, anybody up in Canada, I have some wonderful friends up there. I d hope you're all doing well with the terrible wildfires. I'm so sorry about that. Um, it's been dry down here though. It's, oh gosh, we, it's just been so dry. I wish it would rain, just pour. <laughs> it's just been so dry and, um, so I don't know, hopefully it will, I mean, for the farmers and everybody. But anyway, I, I, I guess I'll start out with uh, my daughter that lives here. She broke her nose um, June 2nd. Um, her and um, Mark and my son-in-law, her husband Mark and grandson Gavin, they all love, um, they love the outdoors. They love camping, anything, trail, uh, dirt bikes, everything. Um, they just, that's their thing. And so uh, uh, kind of like, I'll kind of um, back, go back a little bit, but if any of you watch me, um, she does have Crohn's disease and so um, it's been hard for her to um, sit on long periods of time. So uh, her husband bought her this cute um, bike. Um, it's motorized. Uh, ride their dirt bikes and like he thought well she could use that and so um, they were out on uh, a trail and uh, she it was gravel thick gravel and she was going downhill and lost control going downhill and flew over the handlebars and fell flat on her face I felt so bad for her um, apparently she passed out um, broke her nose and um and her you know her face was all swelled up and she skinned her knee her legs and arms and everything but um they brought her to the nearest hospital where they were at and they um put some um stuff on her nose um just a temporary thing until she went to see a doctor because this happened on the weekend and so uh and so then she um see she works at the hospital here she's a surgical nurse at rn and so she works in the surgery um department and so uh one of the doctors there uh, told her to come in and he wanted to look at it and so she went in that you know uh early that week and uh he said it it definitely um, is broken and crooked and uh, needs to get fixed. Uh, he said if it doesn't get fixed within 11 days, um, I think that's the time frame he used um, when something like that happens. Um, if you just let it go, um, it would be too late, um, you know. And so, uh, so then that uh, two days later, he scheduled surgery for her. So now she has a stent on her nose, and um, and so I just wanted to update you on it. She's doing good. She um, she's gonna be on vacation too next week, um, and so we'll be together. And uh, she's doing good. So I just wanted to let you guys know, and um, I hope you're all doing well. And so let's just get on with this. <laughs> Lot of um, awesome items here to show you. I'm so excited. I um, I want to show you uh, lately. Um, well, I like I love walking, and I haven't been walking a lot. But if I do, um, it's early in the morning when it's cooler. That's what I like to walk. And um, excuse me, that's my voice. I 
I think I still have a little bit of that, whatever I had. <clears throat> but um, I want to show you this, and I bought it last um, last summer, I think. And it's a Lululemon belt bag. Oh my gosh, I love it so much. Uh, it, um, you know, because I just need something to hold my phone, my wallet, a small wallet, you know, that has my driver's license and credit card. And also, um, my car keys <laughs> because where I walk uh, it's like about 12 miles I think from where I live so I um, and I don't like to leave my wallet um, or car keys in the car well I can't leave my car keys in the car because I lost my car <laughs> but um, anyway it, it, it's great because it fits um, that and it's not so big or bulky so I just love it and uh, I'll, I'll link it below but I I think I bought it last summer and I just had to show you guys because I get so much use out of it. it it's amazing. And, and I also want to show you, also from Lululemon, I bought these um, beautiful slides. Oh my gosh. I've been looking for a pair of black slides that um, for summer that would be comfortable. And so I looked at the reviews and most of them are good. I have been wearing them and they are wonderful. They are so comfortable. I think they are so cute. They, um, the top here is kind of like, it feels like velvet, but it's not velvet. I don't know what it is. It's really pretty. It has like Lululemon across there. And, um, you know, it's not like you're really advertising for them. It's very subtle, but it's, um, it, they're just very pretty not that expensive um, after I, I wore them a few times I ordered a backup pair because I want to make sure that if they ever get discontinued or um, you know how companies are you know if they sell out they might not get it restocked again and so they come in a, a bunch of colors so I, I had to show them to you guys I was so excited over them and the And then I, um, what else? Um, gosh. Okay, so then um, I had to show you also this cologne. It's old. I've had it forever. It's Flower Bomb. I'm sure a lot of you have it. Um, but it's funny. Like with me and cologne, um, usually I don't get rid of my cologne if I get tired of it. I just put it away. You know, I uh, put it in the closet. I have a little tray and I'll just sit it in there. And then, and then I might come back, you know, like maybe a year later, I'll be thinking about it. I don't know why, but um, this one, see, I like to wear cologne. Like even when I walk, I like to spritz it on and it just smells good. I love smelling cologne. And so this, um, this fits so good, like in the car, in between my seats, like I have two cup holders. And so I, 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 I've been having it in the car for quite a few months now. And so sometimes with, if I forget to, um, put my cologne on before I go out, I have it in the car. So, uh, one day I, um, I didn't put any on before I went walking and then I thought, oh, I'll just put some of that on and. Um, I'm not kidding you. Like this one girl came up to me uh, from behind and she said, oh, you smell so good. It's just like you left this trail of good smelling cologne. And, um, and so ever since then, I just really been loving it more. I think when you get a compliment on a cologne, um, it just means more and you kind of feel like maybe that works with, for you. So I've been enjoying that and I just had to share that. And then I got a few makeup related items. Well, this isn't makeup, but this is, um, it's called Burst. And I use their, um, their tablets to clean my Invisalign at night. Um, when I, not, not in, yeah, in the morning when I take them out, I, their tablets are really good. But these, um, these actually are, um, they're like this and I'll insert a picture. I took a picture so you kind of get a gif of it, but what it is it has
What it is, it has two strips, one for your upper teeth and one for your bottom teeth, and you just put them on for, um, leave them on for 15 minutes, and I'm not kidding you, they really, really whiten your teeth. So it's just nice to have. I don't use them every day, just if there's something special going on, but I've been loving them. I really have. And uh, then I um, bought this from the Sephora sale. It's been so long, but I didn't buy too much, but um, this is Rare Beauty. It's a, um, a lipstick. Um, Amber Ashley always talks about this, and I'll link her channel below. She does a lot of, um, she does luxury handbags and a lot of sunglasses, everything. And she does the greatest blogs. I love watching her blogs, but she always wears this lipstick and I love the color. And so I bought it when the Sephora sale was on. And it's called Confident and it's by Rare Beauty. And I had to show that to you guys because I thought it was so pretty and it, it just goes on so good. It feels good on your lips. And um, then, I don't know, I didn't buy too much from the sale. I bought, um, I bought a makeup brush, which I really don't know why I bought because I've, I've been enjoying now just putting my foundation on with my hands. Um, and like today I used the It CC cream. Oh my gosh, you know, um, I don't know. It just seems like I, I get a good coverage with my hands. So I've been using that lately and this I'm trying to use up, but I love it. It's the Maybelline Dream Urban cover and I think they discontinued it, but it's so good. And then I uh, also bought this on the sale um, and it's the Too Faced Lip Injection. And if you saw in my title line, I probably clickbait a few people like, oh, she got lip injections. No, um, it's just real cute. It it looks like um, kind of like a needle that a doctor would use, and and then you just punch this top and it comes down. But I just thought it was cute. But um, it the color is post op pink, <laughs> post op like you just got out of surgery. Um, and when I first used it, it really really burned. Um, and that don't bother me, but um, I really, really like it. It's a great lip liner. I love it. So I'll link it below. I've been enjoying it. And then, uh, let's see what else. Then my friend Carmen um, came out with two more new coloring books. Uh, this one is the Cute Crazy Cupcakes coloring book. It is so cute. Um, she, she does this digital art herself and she, she does the cover and everything designs it all herself. And then she sells on Amazon. And I, I just think this is so cute. And then also this one, the gnome cuties. I love gnomes. And, um, this, um, it's just absolutely adorable. The pictures in here, I, um, I'm going to give these to my, uh, youngest grandson when I see him next week and um, he's gonna love it you know to give them something to do on on their way back home you know to color in the car and stuff so I'm gonna check uh, link her uh, YouTube and uh, her name's Carmen and I'll link these books also you can get them on Amazon and then I found some um, great books here um, Oh, I also want to tell you, um, when I walk, I, you know, I listen to my phone and so I have this, um, it's on YouTube. It's, uh, the channel is called Grace for Purpose. And that's what I like listening to when I walk, um, Grace for Purpose. And so I have it on, um, on my phone and then my phone is in my, my Lululemon belt bag and then I just zip maybe halfway and I can hear it real good and so I listen to um, usually Grace for Purpose. Now Grace for Purpose is so comforting. Um, I also have it on sometimes on my TV. Um, it's a because um, I have the fire stick so I can have YouTubes on 
and it's very comforting guys um if you need something like that on i think you would enjoy it and then um this i can't remember how i found out about this book it's called the story and this book is amazing um this is the bible but it's written like a story so it starts out in the old testament and then it goes all the way to the new testament um i'm on chapter 11 now but i'm not kidding you i i really have been enjoying it um this is for somebody that wants to learn the bible but finds it hard to understand it's um it's very um it's like you're reading a story it's not like you're really reading the bible but it's still the bible but it's like a story and so I would say, if you know somebody that finds the Bible hard to read, that finds it frustrating, they would love this. Um, I know they would, and I've been enjoying it. And speaking of that, I've also found out this is, um, it's called the, the New Testament. It's a spiral um, Bible, just the New Testament. It's nothing fancy. Uh, you can't buy it on Amazon, but I was watching this one gal and she was using this um, for Bible study. And so it's like this, um, you know, to where you can have room to write. And then um, if you're somebody that like me, that also um, I enjoy drawing, um, it gives you that room on the side. Uh, it's similar. It's probably just like the, um, I forgot what they called, but day, day string makes up um, this. Um, it's real pretty and leather and everything. But I thought, well, I'll just, I'll just get this. It's like a notebook and then I can just write notes, you know, and if I spill coffee, it's not, not a big deal. Um, but I've been enjoying it and uh, you can also get the Old Testament, but I want to start with the New Testament, you know, and just kind of, you know, review and study it better. And um, I found the best channel um, because I Google, no, not Google, Google, but on YouTube, I put um, chapter one, uh, Matthew. And, um, you know, I found several people that did Bible studies and everything, but some are so lengthy and you kind of lose your train of thought. Um, this one I'm going to link below, um, um, I'll link her, her channel below and she's who I watch. Um, her videos aren't that long. I think the longest was 15 minutes and then some five to seven minutes. So what I do is I read the chapter, like I read, um, let's say chapter one, I'll read that and then I'll watch her video and make notes and, um, I've really been, um, enjoying it's a different way to study the bible because you know i'm trying to get more into studying the bible um you know that's what we need to do now um to um grow and to um stay in the word and um you know that that's that's how you get closer to the lord you know so um i've been enjoying that and um so i think i think that's it guys um you know, just, uh, I want to get on because um, I'll be gone next week. So if I'm not over to your videos, you know, um, I'm thinking of you. Um, but when I'm on vacation, I usually just like to be with, be with the grandkids and have a good time. And, and so uh, I'll see you guys later. And I appreciate each and every one of you so much. And if you have any questions, just let me know. Love you guys.